So this gets back into talking about passing by reference or by constant. And I've gone over, hey, if you don't want the array to change, you put constant. If you do want the array to change, you just don't put constant. But here's another reason why. Is remember, there's a couple different things that we can do in C++ of sending a copy, which if it was a normal array, not even a dynamic array or something of that nature, I can pass a pointer to it, no problem. But then I'd have to, if I didn't do that, I would end up making a copy of it. And that now you've doubled the amount of space that that array needed, and you just needed to make a copy. The other item is, frankly, if you wanted to make edits, I want to send the original, so I would use the star for a, an array, or I would use an ampersand for some of the other data types. The third way is to send the original, but restrain them or restrict them from making any changes, and that would end up using the const. So the const is a cheating way of saying, hey, here's the original, but you don't give them a pencil to change it. That's fine because you're also saving space is that this one, which the red was the original. I'm giving you the grade book, but guess what? You have nothing to write with, it. Guess, <laughs> but here I'm saving space. I don't have to give you a copy and worry about you making changes because you can't. So I'm easily giving you the original, restricting it with the constant. Have at it. Good luck changing it because the compiler won't let you. That's really what this last feature is is doing using const. You've seen something like this already, just reinforcing. Const for arrays. Notice I'm using a C out. The compiler is not going to yell at you. The compiler will yell, yell at you if I'm trying to do a const for the array and I'm trying to change a value, it's going to be upset with you and basically tell you it's not modifiable. That is just fine. And just to remind you, you can use constant on simple data types as well. Now, again, would they be given a float to, uh, sorry, a, a copy of a float rate to the function? Yeah. But let's say you really wanted to make sure that they know they can't change it, then you can put the const in front of it, and that'll work out just fine. So const is, is really, really a nice security blanket on everything. All right. There's a bigger coding problem that I want you to work on. That's frankly, there's a link. That's how big it is. I want you to work on it. Take your time and I want you to send me the feedback by email or whatever on how things worked out and how things got done. I'll leave it at that. But I'm not going to go over it because I want to see your feedback first. So start working on that. Give it a little bit of time and then we'll go to the next video.